Hey guys, this is Henry from Outer Bridge. Today I'm going to show you how to receive new Discord notifications when you receive a new ethers from your cryptocurrency wallet. So to do that, click Add New Nodes and then select the node called Ethereum Balance Trigger. So this node will get triggered whenever there's a balance changes in your wallet. So next thing that I'm going to specify is the network that I would like to monitor my changes. So in this case, I'll be using RingB and the provider. So which provider you, that you'd like to use to connect to the network. So I'll select custom RPC endpoint and over here in the Infura, so I've created an Infura project. So for those of you that didn't know, Infura is a web tree provider that allows you to connect to different networks. So over here in the network endpoints, I select RingB and then I copy the URL. Then I'll paste it over here in the RPC endpoint, click continue. So there's no credentials for this case, continue. Next thing is the wallet address, which address that I would like to monitor my changes. So for this example, I'll be using my account 5. So just copy the address from the MetaMask and paste it over here. And when balance increase, that it will get triggered. And then poly time, how often should I keep monitoring my changes? So I'll select every 15 seconds. Cool, so now we are ready to test the node. Let's click test node. Right now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to transfer some ethers from my account 1 to this account 5. So go to my account 1, transfer some ethers to my account 5. I'll be transferring 0, 0.0 to ethers. Click next, click confirm. So now it has to go through and we should see the output response in a few seconds. There we go. If I expand that one, that we can see the new balance, the last balance, and the difference. Perfect. So we have finished the first bit and now on to the second bit, which is to send the Discord notifications. So add a new Discord node over here and connect them up together. So in the Discord node, there are two things that I need to fill in. One is the webhook URL and the other one is the content. What kind of message that you would like to post in the Discord channel. So for the first one, webhook URL. Go over to the to your Discord applications and to the channels that would like to receive your notifications. Click edit channel, click integrations and create a new webhook. Now copy the webhook URL and paste it over here. And the content, I will select the dynamic data from my trigger nodes, so which is the new balance over here. And new balance here. And then I'll click continue and click test node. We can see a new notifications posted in the channel with the Ethereum changes from the trigger node. So the next thing that we want to do is to save and deploy the workflow so that it will fire automatically whenever there's a changes in your Ether's balance. So we can all just sit back, relax, and wait for the notifications. So to do that, first save the workflow as a new workflow. Save it, and then just click the deploy. Now the workflow has been deployed, we can also stop the workflow whenever we want by just clicking Stop Workflow. Each time when the deploy workflow gets started, there will be an execution. You can view the list of execution by clicking this button over here. Here you can see a list of the results from each execution. You can also load or export the workflow into a JSON file. Alright, that's all for the tutorial today. I'll see you guys in the next video.